So hi dear Capricorn, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a journal of reading for all the Capri Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the rules can be reversed also. Third thing, this is a reading from today till the 5th of November and this is for those who are in complete no contact with each other right now at this present moment and let's see what's going on. Okay. Capri is your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment. The person that you are in no contact with. Their current feelings for you right now. We have the Ten of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, the King of Swords. Okay, okay. It's like this person is completely silent. They are going within themselves. They are asking themselves the questions. Why this went like this? Why everything like went into gutter? Why everything didn't work out? I hate myself. I hate Capricorn. I hate everyone. I hate love. This is what they are up to right now at this present moment. This person knows that the situation is completely done and gone and they can't do anything about it now. Now this situation, though, this whole uh, like ugly breakup or separation or whatever happened between you guys, it's turning this person into a very bitter kind of personality. Although this person is trying not to get bitter, not to get revengeful, not to become so uh, like, uh, like so much uh, rude about this, they are not able to handle it. This person is not able to handle this situation like a mature or adult person. It's like this whole situation is converting them into a revengeful kind of personality instead of making them a mature and grounded kind of personality. Every relationship in our life comes to like comes in our life to make us grow. Not to make us happy, not to make us feel fulfilled or complete and this and that. No, no. You have your feminine energy inside of you. You have your uh, uh, like masculine energy inside of you. You don't need anybody else to complete you. It's just an illusion. But every relationship comes to our life to make us grow. In this case, Capricorn, this person is becoming bitter. Instead of going like growing, they are going inside of them and making things worse for themselves. Might be they are going to get some kind of lesson someday and uh, they are going to get awakened. But right now, it's kind of difficult to deal with kind of situation for them. Let's see uh, what, is, what this person wants to like. What are the intentions for the situation between you and them? Cappies. If I said Saji is previously, I'm sorry about that. It is for Cappies only. Okay. So let's see Cappies. What are the intentions for the situation between you and them? I keep on mixing Cappies and Sagis. I have to make them separately someday. <laughs> because I make them back to back, I keep on confusing them. But anyways, let's see for Cappies. Their intention. The chariot, the strength and the three of cups. Hmm. It's like they want to hold on to this situation between you and them. They want to be courageously waiting for the time when you guys are going to be together again. When you guys are going to come together or come back toge together again. And this collaboration is very happy, very meaningful, very successful and victorious. They want to wait for the time when it is going to happen. They know it's going to take them a lot of courage, a lot of strength, a lot of patience, a lot of time to might be make this work out someday, to might be like, uh, like uh, make this collaboration work out someday, but they want to wait for that someday. Because inside of them still there is a like a uh, hurt person who wants to, who wants love, nothing but love. And they want to like wait for the time when they are going to get this kind of energy from your side, from this particular situation. Although it's done, although it's gone, they're still holding on to this hope of someday might be. And they want to still uh, like hold on to this hope. Yep. They're manifesting this collaboration partnership coming together, coming back together. I don't know why am I sensing that this person wants love, whether it's from you or from somebody else. They want collaboration partnership of that kind where they are going to be happy. This is what I'm getting here from this person's intentions for their love life. Let's see what action is this person going to take towards you, if any, by the 5th of November, Cappies. We have the devil, the temperance and the eight of swords. I do see this person waiting for very, very patiently for things to be clear in their head. Capricorn, this is your card only. And uh, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius here or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising or another Earth sign. Even if you are not just go with the energies. See the thing is, they are going to patiently wait for the time when things are going to be very very clear in their mind, in their mind space. In their head space, they are still not sure whether it's done, like even if it is done and gone, they are not able to accept it uh, like as a, as a done and gone kind of situation. 
so they want to wait patiently wait for the time when everything is going to be crystal clear in their mind space so that they can take the action accordingly so i don't see them physically taking any action as of now because i told you the reason and they don't want to rush towards you they don't want to like make it worse by doing something stupid here let's see the guidance for you guys cap is in the situation we have the empress the 10 of cups and the seven of pentacles okay right now you have to have this happiness you have to find your happiness within yourself first when you are going to be happy within yourself first then you will be able to attract these kind of energies towards you i think you should wait for the time when you are going to be you are when you are going to be when you are going to be completely feeling like okay i'm happy i'm growing i'm good in my own energies then you will be able to attract these kind of energies so right now just uh, do one thing keep yourself happy work on your energies work on your inner self work on your inner engineering and uh, then you will be able to attract those kind of energy so wait for the right time till you are going to get to the point of i am happy without everything and everyone else no job no relationship nothing is going to make you happy if you are not happy from inside with yourself first rule and the last rule heal yourself yep so thank you so much for tuning in cappies i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste